It is the bane of every woman's existence, trying to be in a million places all the same time. We're trying to look our best. We're trying to do our best and feel our best as well. And we're going to add one more thing to your calendars, ladies, because this one will make you feel good. It is called Speaking of Women's Health, and it's at the Tampa Convention Center, and it's coming up, too. It's this Saturday. Dr. Charlotte Durr is a physician at Tampa General Hospital Emergency Room uh, Specialty. Good morning. Thanks Good morning. for coming to Good Day. Thank Appreciate you, it. Good to have you here. Tell us about the event that's coming up. You have free screenings and yes. speakers and that sort of thing, right? Right. This is a great opportunity for women to empower themselves. It is a health and wellness seminar for women this weekend at the Tampa Convention Center. They offer health screenings, the chance to speak with doctors who are leaders in their specialties, who will be given the, the discussions that are going to be held at this event and uh, there's a lunch as well and just a great opportunity to learn more about women's health and how to balance your lives and act quickly yes act very quickly that's right because today is the last day that you can get tickets today at midnight because you can't get tickets at the door so you cannot those who are interested okay. need to get their tickets today okay very good and you say that there are five things that every woman can do to really pretty much lengthen our lives. What is that? Right. Well, there may be more than five, but we'll focus on <laughs> okay, five. Okay, that's so true. We'll focus on five today. So the first is preventive health measures as it regards to cancer screening. So I think this month in particular, we're very focused on breast cancer and certainly seeing your doctor, getting your mammograms done, performing your self-breast exams every month is very, very important. I think most people are very vigilant about that, but also skin cancer. Mm -hmm. We live in this wonderful, right. beautiful, bright, shiny state, but we're exposed to the sun every day. Wearing your sunscreen, covering yourselves with a hat or long sleeve clothing is also very important. Cervical cancer, very common in women, even though there is a vaccine to help prevent cervical cancer, still need to see the gynecologist on a yeah. regular basis, get your pap smears done, and colon cancer, lung cancer, these are all very prevalent, and you need to see your physicians about the appropriate screening tests. And heart disease is a big Absolutely. killer. Absolutely, and we need to be very good about monitoring our blood pressure, our blood sugars, keeping an eye on the cholesterol, of course, diet, yeah. exercise, and exercise brings me to the next thing that we tend to neglect right. and that is exercise 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 in just 30 minutes a day most days of the week is going to cut your chances of osteoporosis wow. you're going to look better feel better you're going to decrease your risk of cancer stroke that heart disease that we just uh -huh. mentioned and it helps to ward off depression as well and have more energy on top exactly. of it exactly which i never understood why you exercise to get more energy but it works it absolutely it? <laughs> works and one thing that we forget to do is wherever you are be there and by that i mean stop focusing on the negatives there's some things we can't change about ourselves so what we can make ourselves more positive hang out with more positive people, bring joy into our lives, okay. find things to do that are going to make us happy. Maybe that's volunteering in the community, helping others is going to make you happy. And by feeling better about yourself, you're going to live a healthier life. You know, it sounds so silly, but you're right. Wherever you are, be there 100%. And it and sounds simple, but yeah, it can be very hard to do. And it also brings us to the last one, work harder on yourself than... Then the career that we spend yes. so much time focusing on, whether that is work uh, at the workplace or working at home, taking care of your children. You know, things that we currently have may not always be there. We might not have that current job. Our kids are eventually going to graduate yeah. and move on. So we have to focus on educating ourselves, empowering ourselves now, and being ready for the next step of yeah. our lives. Because it will be here. It will be here. Absolutely. Like that one commercial says, be a little selfish. You know? Sometimes you got it's the to. right thing to do to pay for yourself. Dr. Deer, it is a pleasure to meet you, and good luck on uh, Saturday. Again, let's tell everybody about the, the event. It is Saturday uh, at the Tampa Convention Center. It runs from 8 a.m. to 2.30 p.m., but you have to get your ticket by midnight tonight, or you can't go on Saturday.